I'm just like a so good person. Canal with my It's the Aspuna. Call me crazy. I can subscribe. Go on up, with me. It's the Aspuna. Call me crazy. Like and subscribe. Go on up, with me. with another episode as you can see by the title this is another sneaker review but before we even get into that make sure you like make sure you comment make sure you subscribe wait hold up you not subscribed yet all right what are you doing no seriously what are you doing i'm gonna give you about 10 seconds to hit that subscribe button why because it's sierra spooner should have subscribed sooner so i'm gonna go ahead and give you 10 seconds all right 10 seconds And now that you are subscribed, make sure you hit that notification bell so you get more notifications of my every time I post a new episode. And without further ado, let's get into these <laughs> sneakers. So today we have the Woman Starfish Fours, and I'm super excited to review these because I felt like these sneakers were really slept on. Let's see if it's worth the price because they a little interesting and they 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 a little high price to be honest but let's see if it's worth it so as you can see it comes in a white box the sizing is right there when you open it up it has the white paper and 23 all in gold Ooh. Ooh. This is what the sneakers are looking like in the box. Okay, so right off the bat, I can tell you guys that they do not come with extra laces. It just comes with the sneaker itself. Let's get a little rotation. Okay, it's looking cute so far. It's looking cute, it's looking cute. Let's just get into the details of the sneakers real quick. So you have the basic Jordan 4 outer sole and then you have the basic midsole as well but what i do want to talk about is the colors in the sneaker so when you look at it you're thinking that it's a basic white color but it's actually not this is a sale color as it says on the box so it gives it a kind of vintage vibe because of the sale the sale actually plays along really well with the rest of the colors in the sneaker we have that starfish orange and the sneaker is mainly black so the material of this sneaker is, I don't know if you guys, did you guys hear that? So the material of the sneaker is kind of like this mesh material that's going on, like this net mesh material. And it's orange underneath, the starfish orange is underneath, and then we have the black on top. Um, the material is super cool, honestly. And if you move the sneaker around just a little bit, it also gives it a metallic Feel, which is super dope the colorways in this sneaker is actually really really nice and on the back we have the jump man in gray as well as there's gray on the midsole however the inside of the sneaker and the tongue and this lining right here is actually not sale it's giving a more white color giving a more white color which honestly plays along really well with the sale as well and i'm pretty sure you know once you start wearing it it's gonna get a bit dirty so it might just turn into that sale color because you've been wearing it and it's gonna get dirty because white gets dirty fast as we all know another thing with this material is these fours are actually really sturdy like they're super sturdy they're kind of stiff in a way normally fours have a sturdy type of feel but these are like hardcore i'm not moving i'm not gonna crease type of feel these are hard like they're super hard i wonder if they're gonna be comfortable because they're so hard um so let's see we're definitely gonna try these on and see how the fit is the lining of the tongue is also open I, I believe, I'm not 100% sure, but I believe this is the first time that fours actually have this. 
I'm not 100% because I know with my bread fours, if we're going to compare them, these are kind of dirty, so don't mind them. But I know with my bread fours, as you can see with the tongue, it's definitely not the same as this one. I'm not sure if Nike is going to be doing this with all their sneakers, but that's what it's looking like because my previous sneakers also had the same thing. So I am going to try these on for you guys and we'll see how they are fitting. Walking around in them, they are comfortable. They're not 100% comfortable. Like I feel like after a while, your feet would get tired, but I tend to feel that way with fours a lot. My bread fours, I would wear them for a while, but my feet would get tired at the end of the day. And I also have um, the alternate 89s. And those, I feel like fours just have a weird sizing. Sometimes you should go up a size. Sometimes you just stay true to size. But for the most part, I would say true to size for these. They don't have that much stretch to them. So I don't think they will stretch the more that you wear them but i would definitely say stay to your true size and the only reason why i think that after a while my feet would just be like okay take these off is because of how sturdy and stiff these sneakers are so these sneakers retail for 200 dollars. is it worth it um i would say that these are worth it based on the colorway and the fact that it is a woman's pair but i would say they could have at least made the sneaker 150 or 170 i don't think it's worth the 200 dollars. i feel like it's a little steep but then again it's a woman's pair right now the reselling price of these is actually closer to the retail price which i'm surprised because it's an exclusive release so i'm actually surprised but the retail price is like 250 225 so you can still catch them for closer to the retail price unlike other nike releases but overall i would rate these sneakers a eight and a half out of ten and the only reason why is because of the material and i might have a little trouble pairing these sneakers with an outfit i just think that yes it's mainly black but i'm not sure i feel like it would be not as easy as finding outfits with these than, of course, my bread fours and my alternate 89s because they're basic black and white and red. But because of the starfish orange, it might be a little hard. But then again, starfish orange actually goes with a lot of things people don't know, but it actually does. So overall, like I said, I'll give this a 8.5 out of 10. So let me know in the comments below what you would give these sneakers. They're pretty dope and I honestly can't wait to wear them, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. Do you guys like these? Do you think it's worth the price? Let me know down below and make sure you guys like this video. Make sure you guys comment. Make sure you guys subscribe. Why? Because it's the average spooner. Should subscribe sooner and make sure you guys hit that notification bell so you get more notifications of moi every time I post a new episode. And without further ado, I'll see you guys in my next one. Mwah.